Welcome to this episode of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I want to talk about this. I just got this in, in uh, the shop, so I'm going to do a bit of a bench talk here today. So one of the things I think is all you guys have figured out, if not, you know, I say Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com because this Video Drone channel is actually a spinoff of my maker channel, 3DTech.com. So with that, you know, I have a lot of things where I make different things. And so I've added a vinyl cutter now. So you say, why, what does a, Joe, what does a vinyl cutter have to do with drones? Well, one of the reasons I added this vinyl cutter is I want to be able to make drone skins. Yes, this is how they make drone skins. If you weren't aware of how they make drone skins, this is the way they do it. So basically what happens is you have a sheet of vinyl and you design out your skin and this is just sort of an example this came with the cutter I just got and it cuts it out and then what you do is you apply it to your drone to the top of your drone so you do the layout and then you smooth it on there so this is kind of an easy way well I'm not gonna say quite easy but an affordable way to get into making custom drone skins. And this is one of the things I want to experiment with is making custom drone skins. Uh, now, I want to talk a little bit about the size of this. There's a lot of different sizes. I've gone with the 19 inch. Now with the 19 inch, this means the opening itself is 19 inches. So it's a little over 19 inch, about 19 and a half. But it'll take a 19 inch piece of material. Now the kicker here is though, the cutter, which the cutter ends right about here, only cuts about 16 inches, about 16 and a half inches or so, which is okay because if you take a standard 350 class quad or what have you, you know, that's about 14 inches. So this is plenty big enough to do an up air, a phantom, uh, all those kind of drones um, because the sheet's limitless in, in width, you know, in depth. So it's just width is that 19 inches. So, the, and, and I really haven't seen a <laughs> consumer grade drone that really goes past that. So for 99.99% of the drones out there, you're going to be able to create a skin with something like this. So, you know, if you're a little bit artsy, hey, maybe you have an Etsy shop, um, what have you, you could get one of these and do drone skins. Uh, you know, because again, once you design it up, it's just going to be a matter of getting the different vinyls and cutting them out. And so to create your different drone skins. Now, I don't know how much of that I'm going to do commercially. I've got a busy life producing a lot of other stuff. Um, I, I probably will. I'm definitely going to experiment with it for my own drones, creating my own drone skins and decals and branding and all that kind of stuff. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get into the whole Etsy thing, selling it on Etsy. So this is an opportunity for you guys. And the piece is, is not only could you do this as a business on Etsy, uh, but you could kind of customize it to yourself and, and come up with your own designs, if you will. Now, I th think in full disclosure, I mean, again, you know, there aren't templates out there that are just... Um, you know, to be had for drones. You'll have to make them. You'll have to be artsy and creative to do it. This machine will give you the ability, though, to produce what your creativity has created. Um, so, again, because I work in the design space and everything, I'm used to designing and things like that. And, and I may put some designs up, actually post them out there on uh, video drone dash di video dash drone dot di DIY3D.com. I'll spit that out. Uh, I have to see. Uh, I'm definitely going to do some for the Spark. I'm definitely going to do some for the Up Air and maybe the Phantom. Uh, you know, it, again, uh, definitely for the Solo. I'm uh, going to get some cool green stuff and, and put it on there. And, and you know, uh, the other piece is, is because I do this YouTube channel and I, I do a number of YouTube channels. Actually, I got about six of them. Um, I also wanted to get this for branding. So, you know, if you're a YouTuber out there uh, and that kind of stuff, again, for this is 250 bucks. And so real simple, easy solution for 250 bucks to create all sorts of branding opportunities. Uh, even back to doing the Etsy eBay shop for drone skins, 250 bucks. You're basically in business plus some of your time to do measurements and, and come up with the design work in something like Inkscape or what have you. Um, you know, because one of the things to do this, you'll have to calculate the fold. So 
it'd be a, a several step process. And, and if any of you guys out there have done something like this before, have more experience than I, hit me in the comments below. I'd love to hear about it if you're willing to share them. Um, but but again, you know, because again, you're going to want to have the folds. So for me, I, I've already got some ideas and I'm not going to give them away just yet. But uh, I'll share them with you when I get to them because I want to test them out a little bit first instead of just sharing with you guys and say, Joe, you're crazy. Uh, but maybe I should and then you'll tell me I'm crazy and I won't spend the time. But then I'll never know if I was crazy. Eh, makes sense. So anyways, just wanted to share this with you guys. I just got this in. Now, I'm not going to be doing any signed videos and stuff, but I will probably do some videos showing you guys how I use this to make some skins and decals for these guys. Um, because I think you might be interested. And what I might do is, again, if there's enough requests, uh, to do maybe some short runs out there. So just like, you know, 3D printing, um, the up air uh, gimbal guards and things like that. If there's some demand for some short run stuff, uh, I may actually entertain that based upon your comments because that's why I did the uh, uh, gimbal guards for the up air. I had a lot of, uh, you know, asks for them and... Uh, so, you know, I'm really not making money on them. I'm basically breaking even, but hey, I'm helping out the community and that's a big part of what I want to do. So anyways, if you're interested in one of these, I'll have links below. I have some cards up there. Hit me up with any questions you have. It may be, be a learning experience. We can do this together. And uh, hey, let me know what you're thinking about for lunch and we'll see you guys in the next video after you hit that subscribe button. Cheers.